Hi guys, welcome to the channel and in this video I'm gonna show you the quite a common problem if you have a phone and you're trying to connect it to the computer you plug it in you only see the charging icon but if you go here it doesn't give you any options of connecting to the computer which means your computer will not see the phone so you cannot transfer any files to it this is probably the same problem you're running into like I did before and honestly I have spent a few hours trying to figure it out and I'm just gonna show it to you right now this is gonna be real simple this method is like a brick it's real simple but it's the number one method how to fix it so alright let's get started so what you might think you probably have something wrong with your operating system with your Android or something like your operating system just change the settings or it got updated so it doesn't recognize the the cable anymore well this is not the case and in this video I'm gonna show you only one thing to do and this is gonna be fixing probably 90% of the problems you don't need to go to any of the settings you don't need to change anything I know if you searched online they're probably telling you to go into the settings go look through the settings go to the some places even show you go to the developers mode which is like uh, it's possible to do and uh, you know you can you can do that but usually that's not the case with when you just have the regular phone and it's supposed to connect to your computer like no problem so we're not gonna go through all these settings right now we're just gonna fix it instantly okay so the main problem why you see this charging icon here but you don't see the connection on the computer is because you're using the wrong cable like I had this cable before you see like I got this some kind of aftermarket cable where it has a USB a regular USB a on one side and it has a whole bunch of different cables on another side so it has like a, this real wide one it has like a iPhone it has a micro USB and it has another kind of USB micro USB connection so yeah I thought well this is great you know you can plug in a whole bunch of different devices and it's gonna be working perfectly well no this is not a good thing this is called a charging cable there is two types of cables one is the charge cable and it's only good for charging so if you're trying to connect your phone with this cable to computer it will not work you can change all the settings in the world it never gonna work so make sure if you run into this problem first check your cable and I'm guarantee once you check the cable you'll find that this is a problem when you get a cable with the phone it comes as a transfer and charging cable you can see here it has a super speed 10 which is the transfer cable so this one will also charge the phone as well as it will transfer files from the phone to your computer and vice versa so to do that you want to make sure you're using either the genuine cable that came with your phone like either LG Samsung or whatever phone you have but if you don't have that cable what you can do you can buy an aftermarket cable look for this blue USB that means it's a USB 3.0 so this will transfer your data real quick also sometimes even if you have a data transfer cable you see how with time it gets old it starts to tangle and it can kink like I can already see there is some kind of a kink over here at the connection the cable has a lot of wires inside and some wires are responsible for charging some wires are responsible for data transfer so if one of these wires break and it's happened to be the data transfer wire well you might still be able to charge your phone with this cable but it will not properly work when you connect it to your computer so this is a real issue you think the cable is good it came with your phone so it should work but and it doesn't really show like it's broken you know like it could be broken internally but it's not gonna show the like real like the wire is not gonna be poking out right so if you're sure you're using the data transfer cable it still doesn't work well I do suggest you get a new cable because that might fix your issue 90% of the time I just have got this nice cable from Amazon and this is a USB type C and what I like about this cable it has a braid outside so it doesn't kink as much you can actually coil it up like this and it's not kinking and it also doesn't tangle as much so that means it's not gonna break as quick and it's got a pretty good connection here like if you're looking at this one versus this one 
you can see how this cable is just barely connected here so it's easy to kink here it's got a pretty good strong connection here so this will last you much longer than the regular cable and also this is a USB 3.1 so that's the quickest cable you can get nowadays for the USB type C let's go ahead and connect the cable right now as you can see I just got it connected I plugged it in the computer my computer instantly recognized it so when you go down here you see the file transfer options so you just click here it gives you a few different usb connection options you can use it either as just charging you can use it as a power supply for the uh, for other connected device you can use it as a file transfer so this is what you've been looking for you're just going to be using the file transfer option and this is it yeah this is that simple so your cable is your number one thing to check before trying going through the million different settings and reading hundreds of different forums which give you million different advices which don't work so yeah they might be good in case there is really an issue with your phone but 99 percent of the time is just a simple cable and honestly i have found it myself i was trying to figure it out for a few hours until it hit me an idea you know just check the cable and i just wanted to share with you guys hopefully that will save some time for somebody and if you do find this helpful, please don't forget to like this video, also subscribe to the channels and hit that notification bell so you don't miss new videos. Also let me know in the comment section below if you face that issue and I just want to know how many people found this helpful and it helped them. Also let me know if it didn't help you and, and how did you fix the problem or did you fix it at all. So I'll be curious to know. If it doesn't work, well, there's probably some issues with your phone. It could be a faulty connector, it could be just loose, or you know, it could be wore out. So that could be another reason, you know, the bad connection at the bottom of your phone. So that could be an issue besides the cable. Or you can also try to change to a different USB port. Sometimes one USB port just doesn't work. You just try it into another USB port and that should fix the problem. I would say 99% of the time I'm just keep repeating that because that's really important and yeah so hope you guys like this video and have a nice day and I'll see you in the next video bye bye